Today I'm going to take you through the good agronomic practices of cabbages as well as fertilizer application. Farmers, we should know that it is important for us to have the muddy boots. Know your cabbages by name. This is the most important agronomic aspect that you can do in the field. Cabbages, you can transplant them from seedlings. We expect farmers to work with the different nurseries as well as do their own seed bed and make sure that we transplant a disease-free seedling. When you're coming to the plant population, we are saying for SCV Majesty as well as Delight, we expect farmers to work with a 60 by 60 centimeter planting stations. And for Fabiola and Macanta, you can work with your 50 by 60 centimeter from one plant to the other. It is very important that when you are coming to the land preparation of our cabbages, our planting depth should be above 50 centimeters. Farmers, we should be having the probes that we use in the different fields so that we are certain that our planting depth is above 50 centimeters. For some farmers that we have been visiting across Zimbabwe, they are getting a quite a good cabbage size from doing trenches. Trenches should be having a depth of plus or minus 40 centimeters. We can apply our manure in the trenches as well as our basal fertilizers. Farmers, remember number one key aspect of unlocking the genetics from seed core vegetables is making sure that we do our soil analysis so that we know how much feed is in our soil as well as our pH. Without doing the soil analysis, we encourage farmers to use high C fertilizers at cup number 30 per every planting station. Upon transplanting your seedlings, we expect farmers to drench chemicals which guard against our cutworm. From there, farmers, we come up with our AN. It is important that we make sure that we feed our cabbage crop with the correct cup sizes. In summer, we're expecting our farmers to do a weekly application of AN fertilizers, starting with week one at 2,5 grams per plant, going to the 8 grams and on the last week applying a 5 grams per plant. It is also important to realize that our fertilizers uh, on cabbages we require foliar fats and we should be applying these foliar fats on our cabbages within the first 30 days. Also on our cabbages, it is also important to note that in terms of irrigation, we are looking at our overhead irrigation. Cabbage thrives very well over overhead irrigation. But during winter, yes, farmers, we can use our drip irrigation.